Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. Now, as you can see, the contract has dropped. And by the way, I'm playing this just before 6 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday. Yay, 100k. This seems to be... But the way it's been busy as of late, you know, with the holidays closing in, this might be my only time to play. Hopefully not. Hopefully I get more time than that. But... It's been about four days since I finished grinding my way to a bit over 72 million in anticipation of the contract DLC. Anything you need, boss. <laughs> with a little t-shirt, okay. There are 72 and a half with that 100k. Should be good enough. And we're gonna... By the way, I hope you like the new look. Yay. We're going to head down. There's going to be a bunch of cars that are going to be available for purchase suddenly. I haven't been playing the game, but I have been watching some videos from what I think I'm going to call now my reference library of GTA YouTubers. I'll throw that in the description. Here we go. Hey, what's happening with it, pimp? You know who it is. It's your boy LD. Hey, I know we ain't chopped it up in a minute, but I got a homie that needs some. And y'all just might make a perfect partnership. Let me read this thing. Looking for a professional operative to co-manage private intelligence business catering to celebrities and high net worth individuals. If that sound like you, nigga, you need to get your name on the lease over at Dynasty 8 Executive. And my boy gonna holler at you. Peace. So there's a bunch of vehicles coming up. The, the Buffalo STX is probably the only one that's a must-buy for me. I might get the Chin Camilio, but the rest of them not calling to me so much. Rockstar, no fortune, no Uranus. The two cars I want, a 90s Thunderbird, an 80s or 90s Mustang. I realize it doesn't fit with the theme, but come on, you could you could sneak that in. Can't touch this. That's a doom doo doo doo. Oh, by the way, one thing I have done for this playthrough, because I have the other two characters. I've, uh, one of the things I have done is turn the music back on. I'm going to take a risk on this one because music is so key to this DLC. That we'll try, we're going to try and do it with the music on. Hopefully, they just add ads. If it gets blocked, then I'll have to hit the button to mute everything. Excuse me. I'm sorry. <sighs> Up to, so, if if this if this playthrough gets all chopped up, well then we'll just uh, we'll we'll do it again with Rusty Jack. We're gonna do it again with Rusty Jack just for the parking. But well, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna just upload these files as they are ready. Let's go take a look at the uh, the new gun. We've got the money. How you doing? I'm doing great. We've got the money for this DLC. I mean, it might take half my money or something like that if I really go wild with it. Uh, I'm, I'm going to fully upgrade the agency when I get it. 299 weapons. Not going to get too much in the way of armor yet, I don't think. Because, you know, Christmas is around the corner. Well, maybe we should. There's going to be missions involved with this. We should probably not be cheap about having some super heavy on me. It'll fill up the rest of the slots eventually. If they give the, when we get the free money. Let's see how are we doing here? Tear gas full grenades. We need some grenades. Sticky bombs. Prox mines. Yeah, all right, we're good. So where is this super heavy rifle? The heavy rifle. There we go. Has just been unlocked. 30 round answer to the critical question, how I get this guy off my back. It's supposed to be really good. Extended clip, of course. Scope, of course. Flashlight, of course. Suppressor, yes. Grip, make it comfy. That's the family's finish. As I look through the bottom of my glasses at it. Oh no, there's the fence. It's locked. You have to, you have to unlock that. Black tent. Army tent, green tent, gold and platinum. I, I don't know. Yeah. 
It looks like they seem a little bit. It's just the lighting. Trees go with the most expensive to the platinum. Until we unlock the family's finish. Which, I don't know if that calls to me. We'll see. So we've got a new weapon in the, the thing here. I don't know, do we make it a Mark II? We'll have to see, but at least we've got the gun. I think Pyrealm said he did some experimenting with it. and If you make it a Mark II and give it the armor piercing, it's a one-shot one shot kill on players. Now let's, let's get some waypoints out here. If you go to... That's Dynasty 8, he said, right? Dynasty 8 Executive Agencies. They've given it a separate thing. Let's look around here. You got Rockford Hills, Vespucci Canals, Little Soul, and uh, Howard. Now, I'm interested in these. Can we set a waypoint on that? Can you, can you just set a waypoint? Well, you used to be able just to set a waypoint and go there. Yeah, not a, get one too many things here. All kinds of new things showing up. Alright, let's look. Where is that? Okay. So right there. Not far. This would be my choice if I wanted to keep it keep it tight with my office and stuff like that and all my other businesses. Me thinks. But I'm interested in a lot of things with this. You know, access to to the roads. This is right across from the uh, Okay, well you got good access to the highway here. If that's the entrance, it's, you don't have to go up too many steps. Did you see a flying car? And let's see, is that uh, there's the garages? You have to kind of go in a little bit to get to that one. That's oh, there. Maybe it's right in here. All right. Well, that's not too bad. Okay, let's find another one. That's that's a consideration because you know it would be really really convenient to go from there to my nightclub into the office. Rockford Hills. That doesn't look as convenient. Let's see. It's the other side of the bridge there. Also, can also close to my. Uh, to all my businesses. I wonder if they place these here because they know people tend to congregate in this area. So where the heck? Is I'm lost. There's nothing here that looks like it would fit. What would it be? How far off am I here? Is it that building? Set them up a little bit. I, I'm down the block a little bit too far.
Whatever happened to the thing where you just set a waypoint, you know? I know, you can laugh at me because I don't know my way around. Even though I drive this constantly. I'm looking for the building. I mean, here's Rockford Hills. So it should be... Somewhere here, right? Where's that building with all the steps? Yeah, the curve in the road. Okay, if we go up here, we should be able to line right up on it. Is that it? <laughs> You're landing on it, Black Knight. Okay, it's over... It's down this way. I'm over too far, okay. Well, this is close to the golf course. And the golf course, that would help us out with at least one mission. Okay, here it is here. He thinks. No, that's not it. Oh, wait a minute. There's that bridge. Was on the map. Is that it here? That's it there. That looks inconvenient as far as getting in and out. That's one thing if you looked at it on the... Maybe I'm even... Maybe they're all just similar buildings. I don't know. Alright, it's not calling to me in any case. I can't even find the thing properly. It's not distinctive enough as far as... I'm concerned. This is that, right? So therefore, looking at the map, should be like right down. Let's call it up again. Other side of the road, right on the corner where the bend, where the road bends. Why doesn't it look the same? It's just because it's too early in the morning. It's a funny whole thing here. Old age, I guess. This is showing more of like a so down this way, turn around. Shit. Right, let's yeah, let's look more over this way. Nah, not likely. Is that it there? What's the other one I was looking at? Yeah, I think I looked at the wrong one. Okay, hold on. Embarrassing. Well, I'm not going to do any editing with this. Let's see. This one here. Yeah, that's the, oh, this is the other one I was thinking about looking at. This one here is catty corner directly to that. Just up on... Just after that one bend in the road. Going this way. So it should be like here. So I think that's finally it. 
And yeah, that is just too many steps. It's one of those couple. And they're not real distinctive. Not easy to... I mean, you'll be have a waypoint eventually, but none of these are calling to me. Let's look at the others. The little soul that that looks way too uh, way too complicated. As far as getting in, a lot of lot of space here, but not as not as fancy dancy as one would hope. This great house comes with the delightful use of little soul ambience, a soothing mix of nightlife, gang crime, and the howling curbside breakdowns of lonely businessmen. Okay, nah, I'm thinking not. Which leaves Howick. All the way up here, just across from the casino, which would be another, another nice, nice touch. I think we could work with that. <coughs> it's either Hawick or the one really near the offices. It's got to be like right here. I mean, there's some things about picking these out. Like, the most expensive ones are probably near where most of the action is. Because they, they know where the, uh, the missions go. This is a little distant, I know, for the first mission, but... Somewhere this building here. Okay, a lot of steps to walk in, but that that is really good garage access. Look at that. You come right off the right off the road here. Zip right in there. That's probably a good choice. It's expensive. If that's the right building. Is that, it? Is that it? Are we buying the CNT building? Am I getting it wrong? Let's go up here and rest for a minute while we ponder. Is that it? Or is it this building? Which is it? Let's see. No, it's down further from that. I'm too far up. This is... This is up here. You have to go in and down a little bit. It's in the street or two from where I thought it was. I know, you're waiting to see cutscenes. This is all part of the effort. Casino land. It's like one of these. I think it's that one. It does have some. Not bad as far as the, uh, yeah, there's a good garage entrance there. Probably even a little bit better coming off of here, but it is a little bit further in. My intellect tells me that this is probably the best one because it is the most expensive, number one. Although they do, they do, they do get you on that every once in a while. 
But it's extremely tempting to have something that's right across the street from my nightclub. For the long term, for the long game here, what if I'm just going to drift over and do a mission? Yeah, this one here. It's like right across the street. From the Vespucci Canals. Want some European glamour? Pick a spot in Vespucci Canals, start day drinking. Ecolo, okay. That would save me 700,000, which... Again, maybe you'll make a mission or two harder in the, in the short term, but in the long run... You know what? It might be a case of this. I think I'll get that that agency for this character, and maybe we'll go with the expensive one for Rusty Jack, because now that I have some garage space, I might start spinning the wheel again. Well, I will have some garage space. Let's see. Let's see how that goes. All right, you ready to do this? The Spucci Canals. All right, Art. I should probably land. <laughs> yeah, we'll do this from the roof of our office. How's that sound? Let's see, you got this. Make it big, nothing is free. It's at least a little more colorful. I think we'll go with the brighter and happier. Wallpaper. They're definitely locking into a certain vibe. <coughs> I don't know, I might leave the wallpaper alone, because none of this is really calling to me. Like, yeah, that's going to be a huge improvement. And for half a million dollars, yeah, that's... The highlight. I feel like we should do a green highlight, because this is... You're working with Franklin, and that's his color. You know? That and the fact that the rest of them are a little... Not calling to me. Nothing's really working for you. We'll go with green. The blue looks more like gray. You know, it's... Alright, let's go with green. We need an armory. Absolutely an accommodation. Absolutely the vehicle work workshop. Four million. Three hundred five thousand. Visit your agency. Submit your new business partner. Let's see. All right, are we ready? Are we recording? I'm gonna do a little panic check here. Yes, we are. Okay. Where's our new agency? There it is. There's the agency logo. You're going to get used to that on the map. The agency icon. Again, you hop off the, the office. You shoot down here. I don't know. I think this is a good, a good plan for...
for this chair actor. Where do we go in? Oh, there you go, not too bad. Ready for some cutscenes? I'm going to hit mute. Hey, can you just hold it for a second, please? Boss, you got a visitor. Oh, yeah? That's who it is. Okay. Sorry about that. I didn't know who you were. I won't make that mistake again. Justin here. Hey, what's cracking? So what you think about all this? Shit, we looking good, right? Look, this is our business. You feel me? You put the bread down, shit, you the owner. I'm the manager. Franklin Clinton, dog. And that over there is my old ass homie Chop. Shit, he don't get around too much no more. Man, everybody I asked about setting this thing up, they all pointed straight at you. A genuine, real reputable. Now me? Shit, I'm a hustler that made it big. Big house, nice cars, a family, and everything. But damn, man, I miss getting these fucking hands dirty. And from what I hear, you ain't got that problem. You run your own shit, and I like that. Hey, look, come walk with me. I want to show you something. Now the streets, I know real good, because that's where I'm from. But now I work with rich folk who got rich folk problems and no fucking idea how to deal with them. You know, like the kid might stole a car, or they might owe money to the wrong fucking people, or their wife might be screwing the tennis coach. But guess what? My homies can help them with all that. Now this here, this is your office. I'm going to get all these jobs for us, and they're going to show up on this computer right here. It'll be small fry at first, but one big client, man. One A-list name. And we straight. Hey, that's our hacker right there, Imani. And she works up on the operation floor where all the high-tech shit at. Oh, shit. Hey, Imani. Man, these kids, man. Knock, knock, my politically incorrect racial epithets. What that shit do? What are you doing here, Lamar? Now, the question is, what are you doing here? Is that who you bringing in with you? Why you didn't tell me? I'm the one who called that pimp, put him up on everything, dawg. And you motherfuckers got the nerve to cut me out? Well, I got two words for y'all. Finders, motherfucking feet. That's right, I'm gonna sue y'all ass. Matter of fact, I'm gonna blast y'all asses out on Snapmatic. Where my phone Man, at? hold on, oh, dawg. Man, I was gonna look out for you. Chill out, all right? Shit, I got something here. Dog, come on. Nah, nah, put that shit away. I'm part of San Andreas's budding cannabis scene. I remember this dude when he was broke as fuck. Could barely get a motherfucking coach seat. Now all of a sudden, eating grapes in the cockpit with the captain. Look at you. And you, I ain't even fit to go in on your dog ass, because you know what's happening, but I ain't tripping. Because now, it's LD's turn to come up. How's that for a sample? Okay, I see you. Look at this some good shit. You damn straight. That's that pie gal. All right. Hey, you get going on those. I'll be in my office, all right? All right. Hey, who is that badass love fist looking bitch? I, I mean, nice young lady with the profitable posterior right there. Nigga, that's Imani. That's Pearly, nigga, the homegirl's daughter. She handle all our hacker type shit. Ooh, that's Pearly daughter. I should have known. She hacking this shit too? I didn't even know they had a computer. Damn, I feel old. Tell me about it. You get going on those jobs, I'm gonna go work on this big client for us, all right? Wait, wait. You mean big, big client like Tony McTony? Come on, man. Tell me you got Tony McTony. Aw, oh, see if Tony McTony will post my weed on his page, man. You got me, Frank? Come on, man. Whatever I got going, man, you got going. So I'm gonna look out for you. Hey, I'll be in my office. You keep doing what you're doing. Man, he be lying like a motherfucker. Anyway, though, now look at you. You feel like somebody now, huh? You OG now. Your nuts is almost big as mine, but they won't be. Not at all. All right, that's fairly classic. This is New Contact Franklin. 
The prison break. Oh my goodness. Yeah, good luck with that. Why are people doing the prison break? Yeah. Yeah, I have. I got. I've got a prison break video coming out at some point, and it just just sheer pain. Okay, how do we? I don't want to do the mission just yet. I mean, we can do it with the. You don't necessarily need to have a uh, one of the new vehicles. Although I plan on getting one of the new vehicles. How do we get out? There you go. What's up here? Okay, well, this is the tech. Blah, blah, blah. There you go. Oh, this is nice. This must be... Oh, this must be your room if you stay here. Well, that's not bad. I think the, the green's really working with me for the, uh, the Franklin vibe. We got a video game. That must be the armory. Well, we may as well equip ourselves. Might be a cutscene here, too. What you carrying later? An exclusive discount. So we shouldn't have gotten the uh, the heavy rifle on the street. Hey, you think Amani? Nah, what the hell am I thinking? Nice. So discount guns. That's a nice thing. Why was it in the ground? And there's a health pack. Now that's nice. Let's see here, here, here to to browse gear. Okay, so you can just you know set yourself up with the different gears there. Yeah, sell gear. Let's see, this is, is this a workshop? I would think that would, see, that looks just like a, a Mark II workshop. I should be able to uh, do something. Yeah, I don't fuck with weave. Makes me anxious. But every time Lamar walks in smiling like that, I want to try it again. Got pretty much everything in here. Oh, that's nice. It's very, uh, very organized. Okay, you, you gotta get that. Let's see. Load up with grenades. I think the platinum might work on that. No extra clips, no extra anything like that. Pistols. If you can get close enough, that thing will do the rest. Stun gun. Yeah, I feel that. We ain't got to kill them all, I guess. Ooh, that's nice. Don't got to kill them all, I guess. There you go. Melee. The hammer. The bottle. Antique cavalry dagger. Just in case, you know, that, that looks cool. I don't need to walk around with a bottle or a hammer. I think we're good. Still, the, they still haven't fixed that kind of, and it's probably by design where you can't get. But this is nice because it shows you how much you have in each. And eventually, Rockstar Old Christmas will come and we'll get them all. So, parachutes. I, I like this. This is, this is going to be... I, I probably lost out on a hundred grand. Uh, what can I get you? Let's see, where's uh, rifles? Yeah, the heavier we can't see how much we lost uh, doing this, but I 
10 payphone hits using the assassination bonus method to unlock this. Okay, that's weird. It's the military rifle. Compact rifle. I think I, I don't see I might be using the con this instead of this, so let's just go heavy. All right, so we've got some new tools. You know how far Franklin made it. Me too, shit. Just a different route. Different routes. That's that's all good. Still feeling a little bit lost. Okay. That's yeah. That's my home. My uh, what you call it? Elevator. Exit to garage. Garage is kind of the key thing here. That's why I'm doing all of this. So you walk in. <laughs> and these, I guess, I guess this is Franklin's? Now, somewhere in there they had a, a picture of... Can you drive this? No, that's his. So he's changed his key colors to, like, white and gray. He's desaturated. He's not going with the bright green stuff anymore. But I always think of him as, you know, bright green Franklin. This, I believe, is is available. The Jubilee. Just like, you know, a quick office car. Which is nice. I like to have, like, an office car. You know, I, I put stuff like that in there. Let's, let's do some purchases here. At least one purchase. Shit, is it under Southern San Andreas? Yeah. The Bravado Buffalo STX, which is apparently, according to Breffy1322, completely demolished the uh, the muscle class. Why is a Buffalo... Why, why are they sports cars where they should be muscle cars and muscle cars where they should be sports cars? I guess it's it's a rock star thing. We've got the trade price because we bought the, uh, we bought the building. Agency Garage. I mean, there's other things you can get, but, like, you know, none of this is calling to me. Maybe this. For 1.7. But, like, the rest of them, I mean, I might get a Jubilee eventually. Not so much, not so much. Not calling to me. Just yet. This is the new number one sedan. This, not so much. It does have a good look to it. Has more torques than its drivers have connections with the Liberty City mobs. That's a lot of torques. Yeah, why not? We're here. Drop it in the agency garage. There's the work center. Now, where is this thing going to pop up? Is it going to pop up in one of those two spots? <coughs> I have to admit, the, the layout a little cumbersome. But, you get 20 spaces, so... Considering I had I, almost none, like maybe just one or so spaces, this is this is really the, the main reason I'm even buying the place. But it does look cool. It does look like it's going to be a good, and enjoyable place to you know to do missions. All right, where is it? Aha! Ooh, it snuggled right in here. Access to workshop armor, absolutely. Armor plating, oh yes. Armor plating apparently really increases the uh, the durability of the thing. 
you can take multiple missiles. The windows become semi-bulletproof. So absolutely yes. Brakes, yeah, that's standard. Front bumpers. Yeah, I don't know that I want to make it catch on curbs too much more than it already does, you know? Engine. Exhaust. Oh, let's go angled. It's something simple. Vent delete. Front racing. That is more Mopar, really. Muscle car. Recessed. I think going muscle car is the way to go. Intercoolers. With pump, with small logo, with large logo. I've been I've been into the twin fans as of late. Imani Tech. This is one of the new things. You can give it some magical stuff. The remote control doesn't really call to me because I don't like going first person. And I don't really see why I'd want to turn this into a flying bomb. There may be something later on where we need to do that, but maybe we'll come up with a specific remote control car somewhere on the line. Missile lock on jammer? Absolutely. If, if the uh, oppressor mark two cannot, uh, the Mr. Mark douche can't get me, that's a good thing. Lights, neon kits. Let's see. Let's front, back, and sides it to give us that little bit of a handling edge. Lowers the center of gravity. Neon color. Do I want to just leave this white for right now? I don't know how I'm going to really paint this up yet. So we're going to see. It might be. I might stick with the green theme for the uh, blue racing stripes. Red, bravado, bravado. Ooh, the sprunk racing. That that has a good feel to it. So you guys rag a rum, that looks nice. That'll go along with my uh, my drift tampa really nicely. Cerveza Gray. Cerveza Red. Half Camo. Well, I'm going to use this primarily as a racer or primarily as like an agency car. Let's, let's leave the livery off right now. We'll come back to that. I mean, I am going to be racing it, but... Louvers, custom louvers, angled louvers. I like the old, the older style louvers. We'll do that. Might make it a little more bulletproof. You never know. Carbon mirrors. Yeah, let's leave them stock. The plate. Ah, I think we got we gotta go. Black Knight on this. Primary weapons, mounted machine guns. Where are they, where are they popping out? Oh, the glare. It's subtle. Let's put machine guns on it, why not? Prox mine, slick mines, gotta love them. Respray, primary color. Now there's the lime green metallic that you had to unlock, which is good for a dodge, you know, it's one of those dodge colors, that orange or purple, generally speaking. But we're not limited here, we can go, this would be more if I want to go with the theme. Remind Franklin of what, you know, his history was. I'll have to see what the secondaries do. What we'll look at it for right now. Pearlescent. Let's do pearlescent lines. 
if we can. Got ultra blue. That doesn't look bad either. So if I was gonna do that kind of a route, that guy with the darker green, lime green. There you go. Bright green with a lime green pearlescent. Secondary metallic. Does anything change? Interesting. I would think at least the armor plates would change, wouldn't you think? Oh, it's something in the car is changing. First person caps lock. The stitching. Okay. Where is that lime green at? Lime green stitching. Trim color. Roll cage. Old cage with race seats. Well, the seats are kind of nice. Let's just go with the roll cage. But the padded cage, so I don't bonk my head, might not be a bad. Padded cage with tuner seats. Yeah, let's go standard cage for right now. Roof, carbon vortex, double vortex, and roof fin, race scoop. Competition scoop. I don't know what a competition scoop would do with a, on a on a front engine car though. Yeah, let's leave the roof stock skirts. Give it a little bit of an accent with the lime. Eh. Spoiler, must have. I usually go with the smallest kind of thing just for weight transfer, so a small lip spoiler will do fine. Suspension, you slam it. I think the new all the new cars they've been making you slam it for a little bit of a race transmission. Obviously we want a turbo. Wheels? I'm almost tempted. I know that tires can't clip doesn't work anymore. But there is something about like an old school look to it. Big beefy. You have more options in the stock. Go muscle, maybe it's in muscle. So, oh, mercenaries, yeah, we go mercenary. You gotta the colors. Oh, we need to go. No, 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 we need to go wheels, tires, <coughs> put the drag radials on them, become bulletproof. Leave the smoke alone. This is very, a very old school build. Windows, light smoke, of course. And there you go. It's the new fastest muscle car. Maybe we should try to do a mission while well, I still have some time here. I don't know how long I have to play today. We'll try and get one mission. Just to get things uh, moving. The other car should have been delivered at some point. 
but yeah, that, that is critical. No one does. No one does the uh, sedan races. You know, they barely do muscle. That's like every once in a great while. Where's my office at? Is it? Yep, here we are. Register as a CEO. At least they fixed something here. It's very reasonable. When this first came out, you had to be in a public session to do this, and they've since relented, and now it's here I am in a closed crew. I think you can do it in invite only. At least no one should be bothering me. F. Clinton and partner. Hey, what's up? I got you on this communicator thing, and I can see what your ass doing on the screen. So no creepy shit, all right? Now, like I said before, I'm a hustler who made it. I got in with a crew of dudes with some real experience. They taught me how to operate on a serious level. No more hood shit for me, you know what I'm saying? That's why we got a setup like this. Hey, look, click on the security contract page and check that shit out. Okay. Hey, so look, these the jobs we got right now. After the guys showed me how to make moves, we pulled a big ass scope. And I cashed out. I was making investments, you know, other plays, and doing real good. But none of that shit hit right. And then I figured I should use my motherfucking street knowledge with these contacts. And that's the business right there. I'm a fixer to the rich and famous. But you can only go so far alone, you know what I'm saying? So I needed a grade A partner with grade A capital and grade A skills. Someone to help me turn my hustle into a major operation. And so here we are. These clients ain't exactly A-list, but now that we working together, shit, it won't be long before we get some of those. But look, for now, the work is robberies, recoveries, assassinations, rescues, and all that shit, you know what I'm saying? Once you find a job you like, select it here. Then Imani and me will start moving on our side. And hey, I appreciate you want to keep a low profile. That's why my name is on the door, and I'm the face of this shit, you know what I'm saying? So I'm working the contacts and you moving in the streets. Some of these can be real tricky, homie, but I'll let you know. And I'll make sure the fucking payout is worth it. Sounds good? All right, well, I'll get working on the A-list catch. Somebody who will put us on the damn map. Hey, I wish I could get that girl on them billboards. Uh, Rosalia. But shit, man, I don't think her ass in enough trouble right now to need us. At least not yet. Well, we aiming high, homie. Okay, so you can recover valuables, recover a vehicle, eliminate senior gang members as requested by the client, just shoot somebody. Okay, so that's assassinations. Let's do the, the, the specialist plus. Recover the client's stolen valuables. Speak to the security guard at the front desk if you want to exit the agency via a personal helicopter or no. I just want to go out and get my car. We're going to do this with the deluxe self for right now. What's up, boss? I'll be here. How do I get out? Exit to ground. There we go. Ooh, a little lag there. Hey, look, so our client is the CEO of a fancy ass perfume brand, Le Chien. Whatever the fuck that is. Well, little Miss One Percent just had a taste of the real world. Got herself mugged while she was smoking outside of whatever fucking restaurant they eat at this week. The MO sounds like the lost MC. You know what I'm saying? They made off with all her jewelry, and get this, the necklace don't even belong to her. She has stolen it from one of her rich girlfriends, so she can't go to the fucking cops. That's what we come in. The lost have been hanging out over in West Vinewood over in Tequila La. Hey, go pay them a visit and get that fucking jewelry back, all right? Okay. Whoa. It's a lot of leg. And I've, I've rested the computer for about four days from all the grinding, so it shouldn't really have a lot of issues here. But I, I have noticed that you know, OBS has been causing problems. I don't know why, but 
I was having a, when I, I noticed when I was playing the game without OBS, I did not have any kind of crashing issues. So there's some kind of memory incompatibility here. Tequila. Tequila. -la. Okay, let's see. Imagine we is now going to shoot people. <laughs> Alright, that was good. Was well, this the kind of thing where we could blast the crap out of them with missiles? Now you have to enter it. No, we want to go in with. Armor piercing. Nah, nah, nah. You know what we want to do. You know what we want to go with. Yeah, it's not the new gun, but... Oh, there's a door over here. Where's the little circle? You have to go up. Ooh, it's not even a cutscene. Locate the safe. I hear you. Hey guys, what's shaking? Oh, you want to be that way? You got nowhere left to go. I got lots of places left to go. No, he's not. That was the DJ. Ooh, we've got like kind of a a useful position over the overlooking the, the dance floor here. You just trifling. So where is their safe? You think it'd be up here somewhere. Get your sorry ass out of here. Well, you know. Will this work? I use it so often with them. Let's Go gas the dance floor. I've been shot a few times, so, you know. Oh, I'm right, he's right. Okay, uh, that's where I came in. Sorry. I think the gas would be taking that one out. I got lots of places left to go. You lost, motherfucker! Die! Did he just... They think they made a mistake there because they're supposed to be the. Watch out! All right, let's see. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's with the shotgun stuff? I thought I gassed all you people. No, he's not. Reload time got that one. To be perfectly honest, let's do some clear the area kind of shit. Let's do that. Okay, so no one should be bothering me for a while there. Where the hell is the safe? I just set it on fire. 
I'm on fire. Ouch, 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 ouch. Luckily, you know what really helps if you've been on fire? Snacks. Just, you know, E. cola and be a little fun. Now you're fine. The whole place is burning. That, that's the exit? No, it's, that goes upstairs. Alright, this is, this is the exit. Alright, so... So where's the safe as I burn the place down? I mean, that looks like a safe. Locate the safe. That looks like a safe. People still talking. Where's a safe? We can keep a safe on the dance floor. That door? No. Okay, I see a problem here. <laughs> Do you see the safe? I pretty much looked at everything. Did I blow up the safe? What the? <coughs> what is this stuff? What's, what's going on here? There's still people screaming. There has to be something I'm missing. Is there like some place in here you can go? No. You can just you can go in the front, right? There's still people yelling my name, so there's gotta be You can go out this way, but you can't go in this way. Or is that this door? There you go. People yelling, go F my mama. What am I missing? Staff only did that. There's a door somewhere. Okay, let's let's use the map here. Where are the hostels? It's like next door. Could really use some no clip right now. What the hell?
Pumpf. I mean, it's like right in there. Something to this side over here, but what door am I missing? Another door that no. It's this isn't just me, right? I'm I'm not seeing anything. That's as far as you can go. There's no way that way. Like, is there a computer or something you have to hack? <coughs> Locate the safe. Good luck. Is there a door off of... No? What am I missing? Is it in the truck? Oh, enter Teki, Teki Lala. We have to get in. That door doesn't open. This door does open, but you're just in here. The I'm going around in circles. You can't get there. There's no there. There has to be another entrance. Logically. There has to be, like, I would think it would be that door. Wow. There has to, I mean, there's no other way around here. There's another entrance. I, I'm lost here. Pardon the pun. Um, excuse you. Um, yeah. <laughs> that was the appropriate response. Oh, There's, I... All right, I'm going to, where's my phone? Let's, let's go on the internet. Do, 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 Google. And yeah, let's see. Where is the safe in... Teki La GTA Online. There's 
guys to find the, the combination for the safe, but... Where did you find the dang safe? Is that a door? No, it looks like a door, but it's not. Gang, I'm not enjoying this. Locate the safe. What, what am I missing? That's just the way out. Like, I feel like I'm, I'm literally insane. I'm just doing the same things over and over again, hoping to trigger something. Where is the safe? There's nothing up here that looks like a safe. And yet, very, very uh, teasing. Come on, jump over. Don't, don't be trapped. You gotta be kidding me. Finally, okay, that was that was getting worrisome. All right, let's um, huh? Yeah. Techie, okay, hold on, didn't do your notes. Huh? Valuable recovery of the contract. Okay, hold on. Players are looking for the Kiki Lala safe combination for... I'll find this guide. There's a yellow post-it note. Where's the safe? It's found upstairs in Tequilala and collect the necklace from within it. So it's an upstairs. Like I see a yellow post-it note. I don't see a safe. That's a speaker. My gamer is not giving you pictures of where the safe is. Can't go further upstairs than this. It's we've we spent twenty four hours doing this in, in game time. So it's supposed to be somewhere. It's not. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm just not seeing this. I Maybe mean, we have to. And then again, how do we kill those other people? That goes out the front door. 
Or does it? Am I confused? Nope, that's... Finally! How did I walk around this door all this time? You lost, bitch! Now die! I swear I tried that door a bunch of times. This is downstairs. Okay, so this is where the safe is. Continue to search for the combination. Alright. Like, why was that so hard? Am I just that stupid? Like, what? Right there? I could have swore I tried that door. Mark that door. Well, a bunch of different, just red doors. Well, at least we know we're looking for a yellow sticky, which looks like that. Okay, so where's the safe? I know it's... Oh, there you go. Well, thank you for the big green arrow, finally. Reselect shotgun. Exit Tequilala. Are they surrounding my flying car? Okay. Okay, people are coming after me. I'm relatively safe. Oh, darn. Okay. Well. Well, then, you know, I tried to get away a little bit more friendly. They really put you far away on this. So, that was slightly disastrous. But now we can just do this. Don't even bother with the missiles, you know? Alright, that was somewhat annoying because I couldn't find the door. I tried every door but the one I needed to try. Ah, that's just embarrassing, but hey. I'm here to share my experiences with you, okay? This isn't like an expert playthrough. I've never done this before, and now you get to see exactly what can happen. Let's see, where's the entrance? Right there. And bip. Completing more security contracts will permanently increase your daily earnings. Earning earned cash can be collected from your office safe at the agency. So it's a passive business. Very nice. Very nice. And they give you incentive to grind. Now, did that unlock the, uh... 
the main storyline. VIP contract. Not yet. You're supposed to only have to do one of those. All right, we could draw that. Let's do a rescue operation. There's a short delay. They put that in? Really? Stupid short delay. Maybe after the short delay we get the, the VIP contract. All right, for the short delay... Um, should we go mod go and upgrade our uh, Tink Amelia? This it can't hurt. Do you do exit to garage? Okay, so they didn't put it here. Someone's taking Franklin's car, even though he's sitting up there. There it is. Not a bad looking car. We'll armor it up. Brakes. Bumpers. You can get crazy with it. I like the smooth lines as it is. The stock exhaust is actually kind of nice. Stock chrome grill. We can chrome it up. Let's just chrome it. Hood. I'm getting a real um, green anaconda feel off this, much like my other. Uh, let's go with that. We will go with that kind of a green on this one. Do that for right now, just for the performance aspect of it. Livery. Ooh, faded purple. That looks nice with the lime. We can race. Yogarishima. I think faded purple. We gotta go faded purple. Mirrors, probably just secondaries or mud guards. Plate, obviously. Black Knight, yellow and black. There we go. Respray, primary color. Going a little different this time. It's still going to be in the greens. Although, you know, we can let's let's look at this as it changes. Ultra blue kind of works. Now this time I'm thinking like an olive green. Dark green works, but like an olive. With you go over the pearlescent. Where are the greens? Where's my lime green? There you go, lime green pearlescent. Does it screw up the purple too much? Purple fade with the green anaconda look there.
We're going with it. Or should I change the livery and just leave that off? Secondary color, metallic. Oh, let's just go all over. Let's just make it, let's just match it up. I know I normally go secondary for the highlight, but that doesn't look right. Back up to livery. Does it look better with none? It might. Yeah, we'll leave it. It's a cool purple. Good enough for right now. Uh, mirrors. That doesn't really matter. Mud guards. Plate. Respray. Roof. Sports roof. Why am I like not going for the mods as a way? You know, just uh, going for minimalism. Primary lip. Sun strips? No, we're not doing sun strips. Suspension. Slam it. Only goes down to sport. Transmission. Super. The super transmissions can be tricky though. If it gets stuck in gear, that, that could be a problem. We'll have to look for that. Wheel type. Muscle, chrome. Let's get the mercenaries on this one too. For now. Tires. And we're done here. Okay, so we have another vehicle. That'll be set for uh, when we do... Uh, Sedan races, if that ever happens. Yeah, where are we going? There's the elevators. <coughs> to the agency. Did we kill enough time? Not much. Just having a coffee? What about this whole doctor? Oh, my keyboard's locked here. Whoops. I need a new keyboard. What am I getting into? Not much, apparently. VIP still locked. Rescue operation. Okay. What if they change it? Now you may have to do more than one mission to get the unlock the uh, the main thing here. What's up, boss? Hmm. I have to rescue somebody. I'm a rescuer. Hey, what's up? I'm gonna need you to head down to the terminal by the docks. Man, our client is a major importer. And I guess he wandered into the wrong shipping container and saw too much of that after I was shit. You feel me? So, some hired guns blew up his car, man, and got him pinned down. We gotta get him up out of there. I feel like I'm in the right vehicle for that. The Deluxo is rarely the wrong vehicle. If you have to shoot someone out of a car, it's apparent it's, it doesn't work well. But other than that, it 
Just cruise down to the terminal. It's a little beat up, but I mean, you know, we, I think we still have a full complement of missiles, so. I wonder how much each mission increases your, your passive. It's rumored, I mean, I've seen online where they say that they increase the safe uh, capacities of all the businesses, so that's nice. I'll have to remember to go over and maintain the nightclub while things are going. Whoa, how can we wait into like this hyper search mode? Oh, where is the, the missing client? Oh, that's where he's, he's pinned, pinned up. We have to make sure we don't kill the client with a missile. They gotta be watching here. Where's the client? You have to identify where the client himself is so we don't shoot him with a missile. Okay, so the client is coming to me? No, we have to... You have to take a walk. Okay, let's... Safety is job one. Okay, let's get this. Don't shoot the client. It's important not to shoot the client. Where's the client? That's the client. Okay, good. Okay, we get in. Come get us over here. Can't quite follow, can you? I love to screw with the game, you know, it's just rescued in a deluxo. Sloppy Sloppy move. Last words were sloppy. Okay, well. Spawn all you want and then try to follow me across roads like this. This would be trickier if I was using the, uh, I was trying to go really memetic uh -huh. here and use the buffalo. Ding. We're good. Just keep flying straight. Straight and steady. I mean, something like the Sparrow would have been faster to get there, but you know, the takeoff time is, and the protection it provides aren't as good as this, so, eh.
I mean, it makes more sense for you have to do a few missions before you get the big one. So they, that was something that, uh, where are we going? There's a little yellow sticky thing on the ground here. I was stuck there for a minute. Up? I'm lost again. Aha! Mission passed. Client rescued. Where's my car? On the other side. Why would you make me walk around, you know? Let's put that back in my pants. Mission passed. Client rescued. I guess we can kill some time here by... You head over to the auto shop and oh here we go. Hey partner, what's up? Listen, I got some news for us. Shit, some great news. I don't wanna say too much over the phone, but remember that big client I was fishing for? The kind of A-lister that'll give us that jump? Well check this out. We got a meeting over at the golf club. Yeah, that's right. It's all set. Hey, they playing that foreign ass game all day. So just head over there when you ain't handling shit for the office, alright? Oh yeah, and someone in the clubhouse? They gonna help you get dress code compliant. Hey, I'll see you soon, all right? Okay, so we finally can do that. Let's start the main mission here. Uh, let's see. While we're in the car, inventory snacks. Snack it up. I don't think we need too much in the way of everything this time around, but well, hey, you never know. There's a big F on my map. I think that's where we have to go. Go to the F. Fly like an eagle. Kind of the wrong time of day for golf. I don't know, golfers are pretty hardcore. Okay, is it on this side or no? We have to go to go to the main entrance. Dress code compliant. I can golf like this. I can't golf. I've never golfed. Okay, so it's a true mission kind of thing, so maybe that'll... We'll sell all this. It'll change it to daytime. The par. Oh, the eagle. The albatross. The bogey. I think we have to go the bogey, because we're going with the green theme here, because, you know, it's Franklin. Nice threes. Hey, how do I look? Let's roll. Hey, you know in Vinewood, this is where all the deals get done. But if you really want in on it, you gotta play the game. All right, look, follow my lead, because these dudes straight moguls. You see that skinny one right there? That's DJ Pooh. That's our plug, homie. Nah, I'm going again. Come on, really? I can do better. Is this what we got all dressed up for? Mm-hmm, yeah. I knew I was going to hate this. I don't like sports that you can snack when you play. Next time we're going roller skating. <laughs> hey, good to see you, bro. Hey, what's up, Pooh? Man, who the fuck is this? Shit, it's my business associate. Associate? 
Shit getting real. Hell yeah. Come on. Now you sure about this? Hell yeah, I'm sure. Shit, we ready, we set up, we ready to go, dawg. All right. But y'all better deliver. Fuck my shit up, too. Yo, Dre, this is Franklin Clinton. This is his associate. They gonna help us get that thing done, man. What's up, dawg? Appreciate you for having us. Not a problem. Just give me a sec. Ah, you know what? I'll take a mulligan. That was a perfect shot. You could sneeze and blow that in. Nah, nah. Hold up. I got this. This is a stupid fucking game. The things I do for a hit record. So wait, you're the one that's going to find the phone, right? Excuse me, Mr. Uh, Young, is it? Look, we're going to play through, okay? Give you plenty of time to finish up whatever this is. <laughs> you're going to what? Come on. We'll just be a second. Right, Dre? Play through. We're going to play <laughs> through. Listen, you ain't playing through shit, motherfucker. Oh, very nice. That's very nice. This place is going to crap. What did you just say? You heard what I said. How are we supposed to play around with this bullshit? This used to be a club for pros. Hey, man. Back the fuck up and shut your bitch ass up. No! Screw this. I still have friends on the board. My wife's having an affair with the owner. Every single one of you is going to be blackballed before you reach the ninth tee. <laughs> is that right? Yeah, that's right. Come on, Eugene. Me and you are going to make some calls and see what's what. What the fuck was that about? Man, the fuck if I know. With everything that's going on in my life right now, this is the last fucking thing I need. She's having an affair with the owner? I gotta call this guy. Nah, 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 nah. Fuck that and fuck this. If these two guys have what it takes to find my property, then they can definitely take care of this shit. We got you, homie. Good. Because I'm done with swinging these fucking clubs, man. What are you doing? Listen, take care of these fucking assholes before they make trouble for me. And if you do, you can handle my business. My phone wasn't lost, man. It was stolen. And there's material on that fucking phone that I really care about. Unreleased material. You know what I'm saying? And if you know anything about me, you know that I don't put anything out before it's ready. And I'm dead ass serious about that. We got you, homie. Come on, guys. Let's get the fuck out of here. I'm getting agitated. You were kind of pissed off before they said anything. You really need to try something for your mood. I am. It's called golf. Well, golf ain't working. <laughs> Next time, we're going to go skate at the rink. Hey, you two bitches can't wait for the legend to shoot his shot? Oh, where you going? I thought you'd like to talk. Come on, man. All right, that was... I, I don't know that we're working for the good guys here. I mean, hey, the other guys were jerks, man, but... Go. But still. Hey, you country club assholes uh, just Eugene? fucked with the wrong guy. What? We have a serious problem here. Can we use weapons? No, hey, we can't shoot gotta them. kill no one here. We just gotta get them to stop and put a beating on their ass. Now ram them motherfuckers. They're hitting me, Eugene. Okay. Can we get to get into a car and then? It's golf cart warfare. Hey, keep on. No. You have to hit him with the front? That should have counted. Do people do this in LA? Hey, I beat on these assholes even if it wasn't a job at the end of it. You with me, homie? I missed! He juked me! Go, Eugene, save yourself. Okay, we gotta do the torpedo in front of the bus. Uh, you... Do we have a slightly faster golf cart? Ram it again. Let's go. Oh, shit. Okay, so we just gotta get the other guy. He's he's running. One down. Now we gotta get his little fucking friend. Is this motherfucker going through the movie studio? He apparently is. Man, shit. I know one of the producers around here. I hope his ass ain't at work today. He's heading that way. Why didn't that work? We banged him. 
I know those producers. That's Michael. There he goes. Look, look. Why the heck can't? Oh, come on. Nothing's counting. That's. Seems like you have to hit him in the side or something. Oh, I rear-ended him. Nothing's. What do you hey, have? Come on, man. Fuck with him some more. I'm trying. I'm trying. Too low speed? So yeah, build up some speed. Black biz all this, motherfucker. Right there. Hey, right there. Well, this is really annoying. Yeah, we got you now. This is golf cart demolition derby. Please, hopefully they won't make that a new game mode. Now. He don't look scared enough to me. Me neither. I drove him into a car. I mean, that's This meter is not going up very fast. Just couldn't keep your fucking mouth shut, huh? Man, what you waiting for? I'm not waiting for nothing. Oh, there we go. This is insane. You're insane. How come the rear end didn't work that last time? No, uh, no, 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 no. Finally working. A little bit. We need speed. The closing speed is the problem. We good. Get a little distance on him, and then we can build up some closing speed on him. Hey, let's do it for the doctor. Come on. Black biz all this. Get away from me. Yeah, you need to. You need to have enough closing speed to get a, to get the meter to move. All right. Hey, look, lay off a little bit. We need this asshole in one piece so we can have a little talk, all right? Follow him and let's see where he ends up. Hey, now this today they gonna be talking about when F. Clinton and partner is listed on the ball sack fire honey. I don't know. I'm not sure I want them to talk about this, Clint. Yeah, it's frankly, we're just beating up some golfers because Dr. Dre got annoyed, and they, he should have let them play through. Really, did anybody learn anything hey, from? He landed clients the hard way. Man, I told you this where the deals get done. I didn't think it'd be like this though. Didn't anybody learn anything from falling down? Just let them play through. I feel like I have no speed here. Come on, we need to find this asshole. Hey, try to pee. Look out, asshole. There he is. We got his ass. Approach the golfer. Hey, get your swing warmed up. Now let's play. Hey, come on, let's fuck his ass up a little bit. Hey, hey, come on, calm down. Hey, come on, let's explain some shit to this little bitch. Now, good, let's just be reasonable. What's your price? Nah, motherfucker, it's only one language your ass gonna understand. Take it easy. I apologize. You hear that? I apologize. Man, come on, let's beat this motherfucker ass. Ah! Boom! Ah! And spank him. Ah! Getting spanked ah! in the ah! motherfucker. Ah! Hey, this place under new management, you understand me? Okay, okay, yeah. Call Mr. Young. Tell him I'll, I'll resign my membership today. All right, all right. I think he done some thinking. Now let me call Dre right quick. Hey, Dre, he took care of that thing. Nah, you won't be hearing from him no more. But what about that other thing? All right, cool. Look, send it over. We'll get right on it. 
mami. Well, we've unlocked the main mission. I'm just looking. I've been playing this game for a lot longer than I thought I was, and now my buns are falling asleep. So I think we're going to call it good here. Let's see what leaves us out. All right, and Franklin went home on his own. 50K, there you go. Well, we'll see where this adventure continues. I imagine there's going to be just some interesting things that go on here. I imagine it's going to be a pretty big DLC, so it's not something you're going to want to do in, like, all in one shot. And I'll just upload these as I can. You know, I'm not, I'm not trying to compete with anyone in the... Uh, in the the GTA reference library, we're just gonna I'm just sharing with you my experiences as we do these things. So on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night. Ooh, we unlocked the golf outfit. Hoo hoo.